Last week, Idaho News 6 took a close look at the reimagining of downtown Twin Falls, industrialization and some big subdivisions moving in. But why? Our Alex Grant talks to the experts to find out. The whole state of Idaho has been experiencing a positive economic bounce back these past couple of months despite the pandemic. The population still grew. So the fact that we're a net growth state from a population perspective, that this is a place people want to be, that they want to move, gave us that nice shot in the arm and helped us rebound faster than other states. According to Joshua Palmer, people are attracted to Twin primarily because of its location, accessibility to important services like hospitals and airports, and affordability. They're able to sell a home um, from where they're at, uh, probably in California or Texas or New York, and come here, buy a home at a much lower cost, and then have and and uh, you know have some residual income. What also makes it an ideal location for potential home buyers is how diverse the population is, making any age group feel more comfortable. We have retirees, we have families, um, we have uh, young adults. Uh, career professionals that are coming here from other places. So it's a real large walk of life. Wolkenhauer says one of the factors driving growth in the region is open space and telecommuting opportunities. The move to telework and telecommuting, uh, Zoom, like we're doing right now, that's freed a lot of people to move back to a less crowded kind of suburban area where they have more space. Because if you're going to be stuck at home for a year, you might as well have some space to yourself. In Twin Falls, I'm Alex Grant. Idaho News 6.